Alright, before I start this video, let me just, can we all just look at the box here? Obviously, this is not the normal size box from Bowen or Bosch Club. It's a little, it's different. But I want everybody to acknowledge and say, good job, Jason, over at Bowen or Bosch Club. He was pretty excited to get a Bowen or Bosch Club stamp. So now, he can stamp any box he wants with the Bowen or Bosch Club logo. And he doesn't have to put it behind the label. So that's a positive. Good job, Jason. Proud of you. I know you're excited. Let's get on into this bad boy and see what we got. This is the full draw box for, what is it, June? Uh, I don't know. I'm so far behind. I don't even know what month it is. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't. Um, let's get into this thing and see what it is. I already see two items that I love. Like, love, love. I don't, I don't want you to see it yet. Let's do it this way. Hey, wait, wait, oh, wait, what's that? Ooh, I like it. Where is my stinking car? Jason put on the bottom, didn't he? Yeah, you sorry son of a... Shh. What is up everybody? Video Addict here and today I'm doing a redo because my camera freaking sucks and I'm about had it with GoPro. Um, for some reason the camera overheats, it shuts off my preview and it showed that, it, I remember it shutting off the preview but the camera clock was still running. So I was like, okay, maybe there's just a, some kind of connection loss between my phone, whatever. Anyway, I got Bow Hunter Boss Club. That's what I'm getting around to. cut off so I'm just gonna start from the beginning uh, <laughs> this is a funny one this is a funny one for me and I don't have the card so I don't know where the card went I don't know how cards keep getting lost they're just gone uh, I think I have a digital copy somewhere I, I don't know it might be on my laptop if it is you'll see it right here Anyway, this is going to be short and to the point. This is a... I don't know how to do this. I don't know how to make this video. Because me being what I want to be and me what i am been, I would love for these companies to start wanting to send their stuff to me. But at the same time, I've got to be honest with my thoughts to you guys. I may just continue just to do random stuff that I get here, there. I'm going to tell you the truth because that's who I am. And this is going to be a weird one for me because I like the items. I really do. I think that they're neat, but their values are completely off the charts. So you be the judge. Maybe I'm just, maybe I'm not seeing it. I think that I am. I don't I don't know. Let's get into it. Okay? Okay, okay. I got you. Alright. First thing, of course, all things hawk. I love. This right here is a pretty cool little item. It's a tree hoist. Uh you take this thing, you hook it up at the top of your stand, right? And then you whenever you come up in the morning. You wrap these little wire ties around your bow limb, and it'll be way down here. You get up there, you pull your bow up there. By this, you ain't gonna roll it up with this thing. Although it would be nice if it did roll up that easy. Um, I've never tried it, so it might actually work. But you pull, you hoist this up, and then you just reel this in here so it's all nice and secure, and you don't have to worry about hoisting it back up or it or swinging like and hitting your ladder or anything like that 
Uh, and it just keeps it up there. And then whenever you're done, you put this back around your limbs and you just lower it back down. So very cool item. I like it. $25 is what this is, I believe. And it's, you can buy a little cheap rope hoist for like five bucks maybe at most with a little carabiner that'll, you just wrap the line around and clip it to itself. It does the same purpose. This is a bougie version. Or as my friends like to say, that's a Landers item because I like bougie stuff. I, I, I'm bougie. I'm not afraid to admit it. My girl calls me bougie. My friends call me bougie. Um, I like stuff. I like I like nice things. Plain and simple. Next up, I'm gonna go ahead and go with this: the muddy bow uh, tree arm or whatever you want to call it. Uh, this is actually really cool. And at $25, I'm in all day on this. I bought the Hawk ones, I think at like 30. So that's all good. This thing here, you take it, you jab it into the tree, and then you use this and you can screw this around and around. Screw it in the tree. Once you get up to the point that you want, you take this and you put it up against the tree and then it'll dig in whenever you set your bow on it or pull down on it, however you want to do it. Uh, has some little connectors here that you can hang, you know, like your calls, just hang the lanyards around them or whatever. Uh, very, very cool. I like that this isn't just swinging in the wind right here. This has the little teeth where you can kind of adjust it to the different directions you want to go. Like you can move this arm out here, lock it in. But this thing right here is full 360 articulation whatever you want to call it articulation whatever the fancy word for that is and that'll just kind of you know so you'll hang this up here it'll be hanging over your shoulder whenever the deer walks in you just reach up here grab your bow lift it off i love these things very nice very good product 25 bucks all day in my opinion i love it now we get into the stuff that's just weird to me and hey kudos to jason for doing you know trying to find the innovation and trying to get you something nice because they are nice items so we'll leave that at that this is not a bow hunter box club issue i believe uh this is stealth cam memory card holder all right very cool little item. I actually have like four of them already and I have the big version. Uh, mine actually, with all the cameras and everything that I run, uh, I keep all my little micro SDs and then I got the SD card readers where I put the micros into that so I can read them in normal SD drives. This has, now the case on here is not the, the pictured case is not the same case that I got. So I will give it to them that I'm pretty excited about that. All right. This case looks like this only with four memory cards. So as you see, it looks like that only with four on each side. This one actually great time to make videos um this one actually looks like this see all of the different memory card styles sizes you can do a lot of different style memory cards in here uh this is a rubberized instead of a foam like this is like i said this is what the other one looks like and it's pretty plain jane this one has a lot of options so i'll give it that all right the problem i have with this is it came with four eight gigabyte memory cards you will probably never need more than eight gigabytes of memory in any game camera i get it but the world being what it is memory is just it's getting smaller like i mean i've got a 400 gigabyte card in my gopro a 400 gigabytes my dang laptop only has 564 or whatever because it's a stupid Apple, but 
It's not stupid. I love my apple. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> but uh, nowadays, you can get a two-pack at, at Walmart of these 16 gigabyte memory cards for about $9.99 to $9.99 to $15. Okay? This, I don't believe this is that much, if I remember correctly. Sportsman's Guide. Uh, if you're a member, it's thirteen fifty. If you're a non-member, it's fourteen ninety nine. I was thinking it was fourteen ninety nine. This is forty nine ninety nine. That's how much that cost. Okay. These four eight gigabyte cards. I don't. I can't even believe they make eight gigabyte cards anymore. Honestly, I don't like. They stopped making because I used to get the twos. Then they went out. Then the fours. And then they went out. And now you can buy the 16 gigabytes way cheaper than you can. I don't even, I haven't even seen an eight gigabyte card forever. So I don't understand that. I don't understand why that is valuable. Why that makes this a $50 package. Okay. Great product. Fantastic product. Overpriced in my opinion. All right. Love the item. Love it. And I will use it. Use the hell out of it. Overpriced. Next up, <laughs> another item of self cam. This is very hard for me because I really, really want these companies to start like letting me review these items. But they have to accept the fact that if I if I do, I'm going to do it honestly. I'm going to let them know about items that I feel like the price is kind of out of the realm of normal thinking. This right here is a stealth cam Wi-Fi wireless card reader and also functions as an emergency power bank. I don't know if you've bought emergency power banks lately, but you can get decent ones for around $9.99 at this size. Uh, you can buy the ones that are gonna crank your car and stuff like that. They'll cost you $89 and up, what have you. This ain't gonna crank my car. This has an SD card slot and a micro slot, and then it's got your, on power if you want it as a power bank or your wi-fi it comes with your charging cable here um it's very very light okay i haven't downloaded the app yet to try it out so we're not talking about the performance of the item we're talking about eighty dollars eighty dollars for this thing and that's not to say that it ain't cool. The idea of it is cool, but it still doesn't change the fact that I have to have this with me, with my phone, even if, okay, it can sit right there. Okay, whatever. Stick my card in it, boom, it links up to my phone, what have you. Pretty cool. I, I mean, I'm not beyond it, not a big deal. This item, <laughs> right here. This item right here is Apple's SD card reader. All right, $30, and I was pissed to have to pay that. So this is $80. This goes into here. This is as much obstruction and pain in the butt that this thing becomes. This thing works amazing because it's Apple, it's quality, I've bought off brands of these and they, they fall apart or they just, they don't, they never work right. Uh, but this does this right here. I stick my SD card in there with my micro cards. I understand that has a slot for a micro card, but I keep, you know, as most people should, if you're running a bunch of micro SDs, you should keep an adapter, an SD to micro SD adapter. You just should. So this becomes an easy thing. This, I get the power bank. I believe at $50, this would be a decent, decent item. $50, I, I, I'm all day on that. I think that that would be a good quality thing. $80 is a little bit of a stretch. So that's my problem with that. Price puts it to a dislike for me because I would never, ever, ever go to a store and pay $80 for that. This is not an inconvenience. 
I mean, it's thirty dollars. And you can buy cheaper ones. You can buy them for like nineteen ninety nine from other not, uh, other companies that have them, you know, and they'll hook right into your phone. It's just this is the one that I've had the best results with, so I just I use it. It's it's real simple. And there you go. That's my little rant on that. Last but not least, I love this company. If you've watched me for any amount of time, you know that I love Onyx Maps. I love them. I use them I almost, if nothing else, I use them on a weekly basis. Every week. I know I use them every week. And most days, I guarantee I use them almost every day. I'm just being, like for the weeks that I may not use them. But this is the Onyx Elite Membership. This is not a bad item. This is me being me and knowing some tricks of the trade. But I've gotten the premium memberships through boxes before. When you go to the website and you sign up with one of these cards at the premium level, which is $29.95, they will ask you, do you want to upgrade to the Elite for $20? Making it a $50 purchase. And this is a $100 item if you buy it like this. That's me. That's a little trick of the whole thing. They got, you know, you got your $29.99 uh, membership and they're just like, Let, let's just get our extra $20. Because <laughs> it's just servers for them. You know, I mean, what is it? I mean, let's, let's get the $20 and it's, it's, we still have to pay for the servers whether people are using it or not. <laughs> it doesn't matter. I mean, fantastic item. But this is a 50 state item. Like it's good for all 50 states. I've never used it in another state. I've gotten the Elite before and I paid the $20 one time. The, the one time that I did get the Elite, I actually paid the $20. I was like, hell yeah, all 50 states. Let's do this thing. I thought I might be going out of state to hunt, doing some other stuff, going big stuff. I did and I never used any other state, and that's the that's the that's the issue that I have with it. I don't believe that too many people in this subscription box round uh, are gonna be heavy travelers. I believe that maybe thirty or forty of their subscribers are probably gonna be the kind of people that go on hunts and stuff like that. Even if it's a hundred, it's not. I don't think it's a big enough. Uh, sampling of your people to put a hundred dollars worth of the value of the box into this. Uh, I'd much rather just get the twenty nine ninety nine because it gives me my state, and that's, and then I can make the decision for twenty dollars more, and then we probably could have got another item in there. In my opinion, that's what I'm saying. And this is not a knock on Jason because I'm sure he looked at it and he's like, hundred dollar, you're giving me a hundred dollar thing to put in my box. The whole box only costs one hundred fifty dollars. So, I mean, if you look at it, it's $280 retail. You know, I believe it's about a $200 box, in all honesty, which is still more than what you paid for it. So, you got to think about that. All this is really good items. This is gimmicky, but pretty cool. This is awesome, very useful. You gotta, you gotta have a hoist anyway. You might as well have a cool one that gives you some bonus features in it. The bow arm, I mean, I've, I've got three of them like that right now, and I'm, I'm extremely happy to have another one because I just bought my property and I'm gonna be putting a bow stand over there. So it's perfect for perfect timing for me. The memory card reader, I will use the hell out of it. I will use the memory cards. It's just, it's fifty dollars. And I don't, I don't see that value in it. Onyx, I love. I just, I feel like, well, you heard it.
But in the end, you know, it only matters what you guys think. This is still better value than what you're paying. So that is a big plus in this. this that's what makes you not get mad. Because you are still, no matter what, you got five cool items here that are good quality items. And it's more than what you paid for. So... Like I said, in the end, it only matters what you think. If this is something you'd like to see in subscription box and you want to give it a shot, and I go back and watch my other videos. This is it's not this is not a knock on Bowhunter Bosco. This is just a weird pricing. It's all kind of like it's kind of new stuff. So the pricing is kind of just weird for me. But um, you know, if you're interested, take a look in the description down below. And go use my discount code and save yourself even more cash. Uh, I can't, I can't, I can't help you any more than that. That's pretty. I mean, that's the best I can do. All right, that's it. That's my honest opinion, and it is my opinion and my story from behind the scenes of what I've seen. And believe me, I've seen a lot. You've been around. You know it. <laughs> all right. So uh, that's it. That's all I got for you. Tell me what you like. Tell me what you didn't in the comments below. Like, share, comment, all that fun stuff. And subscribe. Play with my ball. Click it. Click it. It's a little dirty. All right. I'm out. I'm never going to get sponsorship. <laughs>